Find insight, guidance, and answers. answers. Tune into Spirit with radio medium Laura Lee. Laura Lee. Laura Lee tuning into Spirit with my special guest, Shaylee. Hi, Shaylee. Hi. Welcome to the show. Where are you calling from, hon? Taylorville, Illinois. Wonderful. Shaylee, I see this man come into my view, and I see, I'm assuming this is him hugging you, big hugs, patting you on the back, see you crying on his shoulder, because I feel like this crying is about his recent passing. And I get like a father figure here, honey. Does this make sense? Yes, he was. (laughs) And he was like your father. I'm getting it's a grandfather. Is that correct? Yes, it is. It's my grandpa. Oh, yeah. Yes, he passed away in January this year. We were very close. He was always in my life. Always Um, giving you hugs. Always giving you hugs. Uh, And he had no problem saying, I love you. Yeah, I've actually had two or three dreams of him, and he's always giving me a hug. Is he? (laughs) Wonderful. (laughs) You know those are visitations, right? Yes, I was really hoping. Those are Whenever I woke up, I felt better. Yes. I had just seen him. Well, I got to tell you, to me, that's 10 times more therapeutic than working through a medium. But when people are grieving, sometimes that's why they call upon the mediums, because the mediums can convey the message. But I don't think it's as effective as a dream, you know? Yeah. Mm, Who's a vet? Because I get a connection to the military as well. Um, My stepdad was in the military. I just get that impression, and maybe he's bringing it up. Has he stepped up to the plate and tried yes. to... Oh, yeah. right. All right, there you go. Because in kind of filled yeah. in the role for Grandpa a little bit. Yeah, he's been trying a lot, especially because, you know, me and Grandpa were very close. Well, let him, let him, honey. Let yeah. him fill that role. He's feeling like, all right, now's my opportunity. <laughs> Yeah, definitely. Honey, who's feeling guilt, like not being Um, there completely when the crossover happened? Is this you or somebody else in the family? It was me. For Grandpa crossing over. And you're feeling very heavy about this. And he says you're restless. There's little to no sleep. And you want to fly away from, he shares with me, the relationship and start over. A relationship, I'm feeling like this is your partner. Yes. Yeah, I'm married. We've had a lot of problems, especially because she just had somebody to pass away this year, too. And, you know, I lost my grandpa, so. Mm hmm. It's normal. Yeah. You guys stop being so hard on yourselves. Okay. I mean, yeah. it just is. All right. So it's typical yeah. what grief does to us. Okay. And he shows me closing a hatchback. In the back of a pickup truck, you know, like a flatbed closing the door. Mm -hmm. Is this his or yours? It was my grandpa's truck, but he had Parkinson's really bad and he suffered the last two years of his life and he wasn't able to drive. Mm -hmm. He had like seizures and stuff too, but it's not working right now. But yeah, we still have it. You have it (laughs) because he's showing this to me and he says that you need to use it and do the work. Okay. Yes. And you need to fix it. So, uh, because it's going to help you do some work on a house. All right. Help us do some work on a house. Okay. (laughs) (laughs) There's also something there about. That it's not only you two that are keeping separate, but there's some people who are really influencing your relationship as well, not liking your partner. And is this because, forgive me, honey, for saying it, something to do about same-sex marriage? Um, I believe that it has something to do with that. They are impressing their beliefs on you guys. So you just hold tight. You can make it through. So just breathe. Okay. Mm. Okay, awesome. Now, let me see here. Oh, one last thing. Is there a relationship to baseball in this grandfather and another son? Does this make sense? Yes, but it's actually football. My grandpa collected Chicago Bears stuff. And in my son's room, he uh-huh. has Chicago Bear theme oh. stuff. Like, well, he got a lot of Chicago Bear stuff. Okay, now that really. might be the case, but he shows me the baseball throwing the little ball to 
the sun and hitting with a yeah. bat. So maybe it will switch for your son. Okay. Okay. So it, while really interesting. He, he might be into sports, but I get that impression. So you said the bears, right? But is there any correlation yeah. to the yeah. Cubs as well? Um, yeah. <laughs> like a Cubs yeah. hat. He's yeah. showing that. All right. Yeah. Just hold on to that. It was a pleasure, Shaylee. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. And if you'd like to be my special guest caller, sign up at Radio Medium, Laura Lee. And if you haven't already, subscribe to our show on any podcast form. It is free. 